Hey guys, Matthew here. So today we're going to be learning how to play Trouble by Cage the Elephant on the ukulele. So if you don't know, I have a bunch of other ukulele tutorials already made. They're mainly 21 Pilots ukulele tutorials, but if you want to check those out, I will include a link in the description. But today we're learning how to play Trouble by Cage the Elephant on the ukulele. So the chords you'll need to know to play Trouble are C, E, A minor, F, and G. And so yeah, those are the only chords you will need to know to play the entire song. So once you know those chords, we can jump into the intro. So if you don't know what the intro sounds like, I will play it for you right here. And so the chords you will need to know for the intro are C, E, A minor, and F. And the strumming pattern for the intro is basically what you're going to be using for the entire song. So it's really important that you get this strumming pattern down. So you're going to do down, 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 up three times, and then you're going to switch to the last part of the strumming pattern. So let's just practice on the C. So it goes down, 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 up, and then to E. Down, 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 up, then to A minor. Down, 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 up. And then you go to F. Up, down, up, up, down, up. So down, 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 up, down, 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 up, down, 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 up, up, down, up, up, down, up, down, 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 up, down, 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 up, down, 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 up, up, down, up, up, down, up, down, 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 up, down, 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 up, down, 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 up, up, down, up, up, down, up, C, E, A minor, and F. And so yeah, that is the strumming pattern you will need to know for the intro and for a majority of the song. So once you have that down, uh, we can start learning how to play the intro. So the chord progression is just C to E to A minor to F, and you repeat that six times. Uh, so let's play it one time together. I will include the chords right here and the strumming pattern above my head. And so yeah, that is how you play the intro on the ukulele. So once you have the intro down, we can jump into the first verse. And if you don't know what the first verse sounds like, I will play it for you right here. We were at the table by the window, the view. Casting shadows, the sun was pushing through. Spoke a lot of words, I don't know if I spoke the truth. And so the strumming pattern for the first verse is actually the exact same as the intro, so what you just learned. So I'll include it above my head, and it is the exact same chord progression. So I think we can jump straight into the first verse. So I'm going to play it for you. I'm going to have the chords here and the strumming pattern above my head, and we can just practice together. We were at the table by the window of you Casting shadows, the sun was pushing through And I like to stop on the F and just do one up strum. So instead of doing that end of the strumming pattern, I just do one up strum for F. And that's basically how you play the first verse. So once you have the first verse down, we can jump into the pre-chorus. And if you don't know what the pre-chorus sounds like, I will play it for you right here. Got so much to lose. Got so much to prove. God, don't let me lose my mind. So the strumming pattern for the pre-chorus is actually the exact same as the one I just taught you, except instead of doing the first part three times, you're doing it one time. 
So let's practice here together. I'll start out on the A minor and then go to the F, which is how you play the pre-chorus. So it just goes down, 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 up, up, down, up, up, down, up, down, 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 up, up, down, up, down, up, up, down, up, down, 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 up, up, down, up, up, down, up. And so yeah, that is the strumming pattern for the pre-chorus. So once you have the strumming pattern, we can jump into actually playing it. So the chord progression is just A minor to F three times, and then you go C to E. So let's play that uh, together. So it just goes A minor, F, A minor, F, A minor, F, C, E. And then it goes into the chorus. So let's play that one time together with the lyrics and the chords and the strumming pattern above my head. Got so much to do. And so yeah, that is how you play the pre-chorus. So once you have the pre-chorus down, we can jump into the chorus. So if you don't know what the chorus sounds like, I will play it for you right here. Trouble on my left, trouble on my right. I've been facing trouble almost all my life. My sweet love, won't you put me through? Everywhere I look, I catch a glimpse of you. I did it for love, I did it for you. Do, 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 do. And so the strumming pattern for the chorus is a little bit different. I will include it above my head again, but it's also pretty similar to what we just learned. It's basically the first part once, and then the final part of the strumming pattern after that, and then the first part again, and then the final part after that. So you're just alternating the two parts of the strumming pattern instead of playing the first part three times. And it just goes C to E to A minor to F, just like the first part of the song goes. And so let's practice the strumming pattern together. We'll just practice on the chord progression of C to E to A minor to F. Down, 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 up, up, down, up, up, down, up, down. And so yeah, that's basically how you play the chorus. So let's play that one time together with the chords uh, and the strumming pattern above my head and I'll sing the lyrics. Trouble on my left, trouble on my right. I've been facing trouble almost all my life. My sweet love, won't you pull me through? Everywhere I look, I catch a glimpse of you. I said it was love and I did it for life. And so yeah, that is how you play the chorus. So after you know the chorus, we can jump into the second verse. And if you don't know what the second verse sounds like, I will play it for you right here. Will I come to pass? Or will I pass the test? You know what they say, yeah. The wicked get no rest. You can have my heart any place, any time. So playing the second verse is actually the exact same as playing the first verse. Uh, so if you can remember the strumming pattern, I'll throw it above my head. It's the same chord progression. So let's play it one time together with the chords uh, and I'll sing the lyrics. Will I come to pass? Or will I pass the test? You know what they say, yeah. The wicked get no rest. You can have my heart any place, any time. And then it goes back into the pre-chorus, which you also know how to play. Got so much to lose. Got so much to prove. God, don't let me lose my mind. And then into the chorus again. And since you already know how to play the chorus, that is actually everything you need to know to play the entire song of Trouble on the ukulele. I want to thank you all for watching this uh, ukulele tutorial. If you enjoyed, be sure to hit that like button and maybe subscribe to the channel. I upload two new videos a week every Monday. I do hashtag ukulele Mondays, and that's where I just make ukulele tutorials like these or covers of songs that I'm interested in. So if you have any suggestions, be sure to leave them in the comment section below. And on Fridays, I just do vlogs where I tell you guys about my life and what's going on as my voice gives out. But I just want to thank you again for watching. It really means a lot that you take the time out of your busy schedule to watch me and, and to learn the ukulele with me, you know? It, it just, it's really cool that you, you just watch my videos. So I just want to thank you. I uh, hope you're having an awesome day. You're an amazing person. And I'll see you in the next video. Take care.